Now let me ask you this. Um, for people out of town that come to Atlanta, it's kind of known, especially when it comes to like artists, independent artists, you know, it's like the strip club vibe and brand in Atlanta is you get records broken in Atlanta mm -hmm. through the strip club. Uh -huh. Is that still? No. No, I think I think it's still. I don't think so. I mean, you got to do more than that nowadays. Yeah, you got to be footwork, yeah. street teams. Hey, it's, man, it's a lot more. Yeah, than that, that strip club I think movement still like is that. dead. I like, mean, it, it they still do up. the open mic Mondays or whatever, but you got to be everywhere. You got to. No, not even. I ain't talking about like mic. I'm just like a DJ. When you go on a strip club, mm -hmm. you don't hear no like top of the chart music, like none of that. You hear a whole bunch of shit you never heard before. <laughs> And strippers be requesting that shit. They be shaking <coughs> their ass to it. I mean, maybe that that's right. I mean, yeah, that right. shit do be word of mouth with the strippers. That's definitely true. Yeah, I mean, mean but it, that shit not gonna, more, that shit not gonna not break it. you. It's not gonna break you like it used to. Like it, like it, it could. Back in in. Yeah, it did, but not no, not no more. So that's not as 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 valuable as it used to be. I guess maybe that's why we not in there. If if it was so valuable, he would definitely be in the strip club throwing money. But. You know, we just do it for fun now and promotion. Don't get it twisted. <laughs>